everyone welcome back to learning fun zone today we are going to design a spooky forest game in scratch junior so let's get started so here we are on the scratch junior screen and let us choose a spooky spooky kind of a background all right so let's take this one and let's add some characters we can even draw our own characters so let's try to design something try to try to draw a ghost don't get scared let's try to design a ghost i know you guys can draw better than me try to draw something like a ghost and let us take this circle and we will draw eyes the minimize this okay. now these are two eyes and let's go back to the pencil and we will draw a smile perfect and which color do you want let's take some like the blue color violet color and this is the paint let's just paint black to the eyes and red to the all right so this is our smiling ghost and we will rename this character here we will write as ghost so don't get afraid he is a friendly ghost and let's click on this tick mark okay now let's add something more something spooky so this bat looks nice Let's delete this tick. Add something more. What do you think? We can take ah uh, this one. Make make bad. And let us add something more. Draw. all right that's enough for now so we have taken some characters and we will maybe decrease the size of this frog a bit i think just go to this purple and just shrink it and we will increase the size of the snake add it and let's add the size of the bat as well okay beautiful and do you want the ghost to be bigger no okay let's keep it same so we have these four characters now now let us add the name of our so let's say happy halloween Let's reduce the size. You can change the. Click on this. You can change the color. Perfect. Let us write the program for each of these characters. So let us go one by one. Let us go to the ghost. And let's go to the yellow. Say, we will touch on this ghost and then we, it will jump. Okay, so I will click on this and let us add a jump and let us move it and again jump it. 
scary right now let's add end awesome now let's go to the bat now what do you want the bat to do we will just add a add the tap button let's go to the motion and let's move it right left and get yeah, right let's see So this way the bat is moving. Now let's move the snake. Let us add a tap. Let us add a loop. In the loop, we can just repeat the action again and again. So we will just increase and decrease the size of our snake. So this is the increase button and this is the decrease button. Adding this both. And let us add a red end button. So here you can see it is doing it is increasing and decreasing four times. Why four times? Because here we have mentioned four. Now let us add code for the frog. Let's add tap button and let us add jumping jumping action. So we can add four times jump when we click on the frog. Try to run this now. Let us go on full screen mode and let us run. Tap on the ghost. Oh my god. Tap on the bat. Frog. Tap on the snake. Isn't it spooky? So, let's try to run once again. Tap on this frog. On the bat. On the ghost. Oh my god. And let's tap on the snake. Oh my god. So isn't it nice? So did you enjoy this? So try to run this spooky forest game and show it to your parents, friends, and enjoy. Bye bye. Yeah. <laughs>